All right, I've been getting a lot of messages about what denture bases do I use? Why do I like them? This one versus that one. Um, I have an old YouTube video up of a review, but let's do a new one. So since so we got some more fun stuff. So here's the original Gen the denture base. Not a huge fan of it. Pretty brittle, um, pretty translucent. I don't mind the translucency at all, but it is brittle. We are just using what we have left for like immediate dentures when we know we're for sure gonna replace it. Not my favorite to use. That was the original guy. Then we have Pro Thracher. Love Pro Thracher. That's what it looks like. A little bit orangey, really easy to candy coat. I put it with Onyx teeth. Love it. Onyx breaks easier than the high impact teeth, though, so your teeth are actually more able to break than the base itself, just because of the type of material it is. But I really like this one, too. I've been using this one for well over a year. Love it. Just got this guy and a Sprint Ray Denture Base, which is this one right here no translucency whatsoever. We're, I got so used to it being translucent like this, and then I go to this. Um, can withstand a one-story drop down to a high floor, can be thrown across the room, can be dropped, it withstands really well. I'm a huge, huge fan of this one, along with their denture teeth. They're super lightweight, but also super strong at the same time, which is what I like. Onyx, in my opinion, is just a little bit heavy for dentures, so the high-impact denture base and teeth is a fantastic alternative. They both turn out really well. And then the last one we have is the Graffy Terror, the flexible base that just came out. Uh, that one is flexible like a night guard, not flexible like a Balplast. You do need to, when you're delivering it, run it under hot water. It does get um, a little bit more flexible under warm water like the night guard Flexus did. But, um, and it is slightly translucent. I'm a big fan of it. You cannot glaze them because it's flexible. The glaze will just come off, so you need to give it a really good polish. But if anyone asks me my go-to resins for a denture, either one of these has an option. I like all of them. So stay review, stay here, and I'll do a review about denture teeth next.